All right, so I want to show you how to tie down the airplanes properly. We're going to put the loop or the rope through the uh, tie down loop. And just like tying your shoes, you got to make sure this is good and tight to hold properly. So we pull it tight, take one hand up here and grab that so it doesn't slip. And now we take the free end and just make a single loop around and kind of move that up next to your hand. That way you have plenty of extra rope left over. You're going to pull this really good and tight on this first loop. You can hold it with one hand and wrap them underneath the first loop. You come back through there. Now this rope is sitting on top of your first wrap around and the free side here. So now you're going to pull that to lock it into that little channel. Keep good tension on that and you come down and repeat the whole thing again. Sliding it up, making a first loop around, coming right underneath it, through the gap and locking it in. And you can see if I pull on this, the, no the knots do not slip, but yet it's also incredibly easy to untie it. You just simply move the rope back through. So it doesn't get in a bind, it doesn't lock where you can't untie it, but it'll hold the airplane properly. Here we have an example of a knot that looks like it ties really well. But realistically, it does nothing. So that means the airplane can slip which makes the knot useless. So if it isn't tied properly, there's no point in even tying it at all.